Hi guys, guess who is back? Me? Yes. I know you might be thinking, where has she been all this while? What has she been up to? Like, trust me, it's been long. Months? Years? I can't even tell. It's been so long. But this time around, I'm back for good. You know, the initial plan was to start early this year, but I don't even know what happened. I mean, one step at a time. So, as to when you're ready to do something, you do it. Life should be easy. Anyway, guys, today um, this video is a life update video. But before we get into it, please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and share. Also, tell your friends, tell your families, and your loved ones to subscribe to my channel. I just got this microphone from Jumia, and I don't even know how it sounds. I am kind of not too sure about the sound, but let me know what you think in the comment section, and I'll be so glad to see your feedback. That was just by the way, guys. Like, oh, it's been years and months since I came here, and I've been doing a whole lot. Charlie, a whole lot. I can't even mention them all, but let's take it one after the other. Let's talk about moving out. It's been um, a year since I moved out. I just moved out because um, I just needed my privacy, and then I needed to feel how life is living alone, you know? And I must say, it's been an eye opener. It's been quite wonderful and good. And yeah, if that is what you want and you really want to do it, do it. Yeah. So basically, that's just about the moving out, right? It's not anything serious. Yeah. So now your girl lives alone and living life. <laughs> you see me looking down because I've written a couple of things that I will be talking about and then yeah that is the main reason why i'll be looking down now let's talk about pageants i joined miss ghana 2022 yes I, and it was quite fun educated and insightful because um i met a couple of ladies wonderful ladies from all walks of life and it was quite interesting and in as much as I didn't win the pageant, I grabbed some awards. I had Miss Congeniality, and then I had Most Beautiful Skin. Yes, I had Most Beautiful Skin Award. I will try and refix in some video insights that I see. Big shout out to my friend Okia. She supported me fully. Like she really went all in for me, and I'm so grateful for her. Yes, so I joined the pageant. We are about. 20 ladies or yeah so basically you go for the auditions you go for the auditions you go through and then the competition start 16 ladies were picked to represent all 16 regions of ghana and i represented the central region of ghana let me tell you one thing i wasn't the usual um the usual pageant size girl so i had to lose weight at a point and trust me no this is not a bad thing it's the rule if you do pageants, you know you're supposed to be a certain size. So, yeah, I was okay with that. I had to start working out. I had to start being on diet. Charlie, it was quite <laughs> it was quite a lot of work for me. But I'm glad I did it because and I like my figure now. I mean, I used to like my figure, but it feels better now. So, yeah, I'm good. And the pageants um, took about three to four months. And then the weather times where you had to vote there were weekends where we're doing talent shows and a couple of activities yes it was quite intense we we're going for like catwalk we hear out like almost every weekend we we're going for radio interviews we we're going for rehearsals choreography imagine me dancing i can't even move my leg but it was quite challenging and i think it made me move out of my comfort zone by doing a couple of things. The usual me wouldn't even dance, but I had to do choreography. I had to dance, yeah, and it was quite fun. And then representing my region, I mean, it's huge. It was quite a good one for me. And, and yeah, I loved it. So that's for the pageants bit. I will um, be fixing some videos in the videos for you to see i'll be fixing some videos in here for you to see um how the pageant was um maybe um i'll be doing more of the grand finale where we were doing the african wear the bikini and the yes speech i think because i didn't make it to i think 
top five or something. I didn't say my speech, but it was in sections where you do introduction, you do choreography, you do bikini, and then African wear, and then talent. Yes, I'll be um, showing a couple of them here in this video. Now, let's talk about work. Yes, so I I had been home for some time and I wasn't working. That's the whole truth. So there's nothing um for me to say about work. And also um I was schooling and combining school with the pageants and a couple of things. It was hectic, I won't lie, because I mean doing two things at a go was quite um a lot for me. And then we talk about relationships. Wahala, wahala. <laughs> I don't even know what to say about relationships. You don't curse. <laughs> I don't even know what to say about relationships. I mean, Charlie, she knew I make up. Let's say you come here. She knew I make up. You know.
And this award is given to the lady who has been very approachable, likable, and friendly. Yes, you have to have a good time. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Cordinality. enjoyed it and i hope this video was um, good let me know what you think in the comment section and what you would want me to be shooting don't forget to subscribe like comment and